And then... What? What? <laughs> Why are my blocks disappearing? What is, go what is going on? <laughs> Wait, what? 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 Hey guys, I'm the Kiwi Gamer, and welcome back to RL Craft. Where, in the last episode, we did a lot of Thomcraft stuff, and honestly, we finally made some freaking strides in the actual Thomcraft. Which, honestly, I still don't understand like how anything works. So you know what? I mean, it's it, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. I mean, at least I have a crap ton of crystals, except for aqua crystals, which I do need to uh, go get more at some point. But that's not going to be what today's episode is. So, before we actually start today, though, I want to go ahead and ask if you guys end up enjoying today's episode, I'd really appreciate it if you guys hit that like button. I want to see if we can get up to 90 likes again on today's episode. So, with that out of the way, I also want to go ahead and mention... Now, I'm not great whenever it comes to editing. I'm still an absolute noob. <laughs> like, absolute crazy. Like, I'm not... I struggle with it a lot, okay? So, I think... What I'm going to try for today's episode, though, is I'm not going to have any of the background music that I normally add in. Well, at least that I did for this series so far. I just kind of want to see what your guys' thoughts on it. If you guys would rather have the background music or if you guys would rather not have the background music. I mean, it's kind of up to you guys at that point. But I'm really wanting to kind of test the water, see how it is. Okay, so what I do have for plan for today's episode, though, is I don't want to do Thumbcraft stuff because I really honestly don't know how to advance in it like at all so we're actually going to go ahead and work on tinker's construct stuff today we're going to try and get a smeltery going we're maybe going to try and get our first weapon or item or whatever it is out of it i'm not totally sure what i want to get yet but i think it's actually probably something i should have did closer to the start of the series to be entirely honest now it sucks though is i have to go out and get a crap ton of sand gravel and clay that's going to be that's going to take me a bit, so I'm going to go actually search out... I mean, I guess I could take from this stuff, but I don't want to disrupt the land. You know what? Yeah, we'll actually just take it from uh, all this stuff over here. All right, cool. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, that dragon can stay over there. We do not need... No. You stay away. You stay away. No. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> We're almost done with the uh, with the sand here. We need like another stack and a half. The heck? Wait a second. Nope, 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 nope. Okay, but what is? Wait, what? What the heck is that floating? Oh no, no, okay, no, it's that thing. Okay, <laughs> we don't need to go up there. We don't need to go up there. All right, I'm almost done here with the sand. At least I think I need. Just a couple extra. Uh, let's do just a couple more. Yeah, that should be fine. Because we've got to smelt some of it down to glass, too. We're going to need it that way, too. Now I have to freaking collect a crap ton of gravel. And I have no idea where I'm going to get all this gravel from. Uh, I got to find, like... Oh, you know what? I could, uh, Actually, I could use you go to, like, a mountain area. And there might be, like, a gravel thing or like with gravel all over the place we could maybe do that oh wait okay this place actually seems to have quite a bit of gravel okay that is not an awful thing cool okay well gotta go grab a new shovel hold on get back here thank you Get out of the trees, please. I gotta go get a new shovel. Oh! Nope, 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 nope. No, 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 no. No. Yeah, that's right. You stay sitting over there. You stay sitting over there. You are not needed. Oh. Oh, this place has so much gravel. Okay, let's try and get rid of all these things before they start trying to kill us. I want all the gravel. I'm stealing all this gravel, please. Come on. Come on. Thank you. And cool. Okay, you have a ladder. Okay, well, now he's dead. Thank you, Maroc. I appreciate the help. <laughs> okay. 
Oh, there's so much gravel here, and it's all free. Okay, well, I think that's actually enough gravel. Okay, cool. And now I have a crap ton of ladders that I really actually just don't want. All right, Marat, come here. There we go. Ow. Okay. Uh, I forgot where I came from. I think it was over here. Okay, cool. Let's go ahead and sleep through the night. I don't trust myself being out here at night. I do have to get... Uh, the last thing I need is clay. I need about, like, a stack? No, no, no. I need a stack of clay blocks. Okay, so... I mean, that shouldn't be too difficult, I don't think, since clay drops, like, a crap ton per block. I think I can find them most anywhere? Right? Clay? Anywhere? Please? Well, there's some right there. Uh, hello, creeper. You are not needed. Let's not do that. Okay, so... Right here? Oh, yeah, this is fine. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Okay, cool, we have enough. Alright, nice. And now I'm also dying of hypothermia. Uh, hypothermia, not hyperthermia. That is the wrong thing. You know, I should probably get some warming gear on our stuff. That may not be a bad idea. Except now that I think about it, I haven't seen, like, any Aussie liners or anything like that lately at all. Huh. Okay, okay. I mean, either way, we got everything we need. So, crafting table. Oh, cow, this is a lot. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Oh, no, I got to turn that into that. Hold on. Do that. There we go. Pretty sure it's a shapeless recipe, if I remember correctly. Okay, get out of there. Yeah, there we go. That gives us eight stacks of those. Holy crap. Okay, now... Now I have to go smell literally every single piece of this. Luckily, there is a little place over here that has a crap ton of furnaces in it. Let me see. This building. Yep, right here. Okay, cool. Oh, where's the door? There's the door. Okay. Uh, I still don't know why there's iron bars in front of here. This That seriously just makes no sense to me. Let's get rid of that. Okay. These don't have anything in it. Okay, cool. Okay. Here we go. You know, I still love, like, the inventory tweaks that does this kind of stuff. It makes life so much easier. Okay, so now we gotta wait for that to smelt. That'll turn into seared bricks, I believe. Yeah, seared bricks. Okay, so we gotta let that go for a little bit. And, you know, actually, no, I do need to make a couple of things. So, while this is here, I'm actually gonna go ahead and take that. Uh, we can go ahead and get ourselves a crafting station. How am I supposed to get out of here? Okay, cool, cool. Uh, Barack, I need you for a second. Head back over here. Now, I also need to make a stencil table. I need to make a part builder and a tool forge. So, oh crap, I think I need another one of these, actually. So do that. Then that. Okay. So, tool forge. Let's go and get that out of the way first. Oh, tool station. That's what I need. Okay, so I need patterns. Okay, yeah, I could do that actually pretty easily. Okay, <laughs> that's all I can do. All right, tool station, that's here. And actually, we can go ahead and make ourselves a tool forge. Oh, no, we can't. No, I need the sear bricks, that's right. Okay, so we'll have to wait on that for a few. So I also need a stencil table. And, okay, that's also pretty easy. There we go. Now a part builder. Okay, I need an oak log. Don't think I have any in my chest. So let's just go ahead and drop down this tree. Get rid of you. Thank you. Did it just have fire effects on it for a second? Did I see that right? Okay, I could be going crazy. That was odd. <laughs> okay, that's, yeah, that's uh, kind of weird. Okay, so this and this. Yeah, there we go. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Okay, so you know, actually, let's dig out this place a little bit, and this is where we'll actually put the forge itself. Try and make it just a little bit neater, at least. Get rid of all this. Okay, there we go. At least it looks a little bit nice. Uh, let's go and keep that there. Tool station can be... Oh, actually, you know what? Uh, you know what? No, we don't need to put that down yet, but I do need the stencil table that can go right there. The part builder goes right there. Let's go and throw the stencil table in there. Uh, I need, I do need more stencils. Oh, look at that. You can actually see the blank stencil on top. Nice. <laughs> That's kind of cool. All right. 
so I need to make more of these. There we go. Wait, can I still make more? Oh, look at that. Okay, actually, that should be more than enough for now. Okay, cool. Cool. Whoa. Okay, Tinker's Construct has definitely changed a bit. Okay, okay, that's actually kind of cool. All right. Uh, let's see how much of our seared stuff has actually been smelted yet. Okay, yeah, that's actually definitely a decent amount. Me all of this, thank you. Okay, I think that's actually enough to get the major part of the forge ready. Oh, I gotta start smelting glass too. Crap, I forgot about that. <laughs> let's go and get you smelted. And let's head on back. Okay, to make the tool forge, I'm actually gonna need a couple of blocks of iron. Thankfully, I have actually just enough right there. That works wonders. And let me see. I think it was, oh no, no. I have to make some sear bricks first. Let's go and do that. Yeah, that's more than enough. Put that there. Boom, tool forge. Now, yeah, okay, now we have access to a bunch of other stuff. Okay, cool. Oh, wow, they actually made this look a lot nicer now, too. Oh, that is so cool. I love that. That is awesome. Okay, so let's actually go ahead and get this thing started here. So, for the basic tool forge, all you need to do is just set out a 3x3 three three layer out here. This will be like the base of the thing. And then I need a little block. Do that. And then... What? What? <laughs> Why are my blocks disappearing? What is, go what is going on? <laughs> Wait, what? 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 What is going on? I'm so confused. Okay. Come on, come on. <laughs> what is going on? That makes no sense. Why is it doing that? Come on, come on. Please freaking load. Thank you. Okay. Place these blocks down. We good? I think we're okay. There we go. Okay, that's a lot better. It's actually working now. Um, okay, this is where we'll actually keep the sear glass, which... Oh, we're going to need a lot of lava, too, now that I think about it. Ugh. That's going to be a pain. So, okay, I need more, so we can just do this. That's not what I meant to do. There we go. Okay, so now we need to make a couple other things. Uh, we need to make this. Smeltery controller, yeah. We need that. We need... Yeah, we need a casting basin. We need... What else? A casting table. We need two smeltery drains. Is it just that? Yes. So we need two of those. Uh, and we need two of these. Okay, cool. So let me see here. Throw that, uh, you know, we could just, actually, no, we can't set that right there. We can set it right there. And the other one, right there. So let's see here. Okay, so the seared drain will go right here. Perfect. That's a rock trying to take me away, can we not? Dude, I'm trying to do stuff. Leave me alone. Don't you do it. Don't do it. Don't you do it. No, 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 you did it. And now he's dead. See, that goes to all you mobs out there. You guys trying to do that stuff to me? You will die. Especially you, kobold. Okay, so... Smeltery controller. That goes right there. Okay, cool. So they actually made it where this thing is like... <laughs> yeah, the drains are on all sides of the freaking thing. That's actually kind of funny. Alright, and that goes there. And then... Okay, I need glass. Crap. Do I actually have any extra glass in here, maybe? I do, okay. And to make this, I can get a couple of these. Cool. Okay, now to know that you did this right. Yeah, that works. 
Yeah, okay, so the smelter controller will light up like that. So this actually shows how many items you can put in at once. You can increase it by adding more sear blocks and making the thing taller. So yeah. Oh. Oh, right. Okay, so I need to put the seared faucets on here too, actually. <laughs> so that way it actually pours out something. Okay, so now we also got to make this thing a lot taller too. Go ahead and grab that. Uh, we'll bring that up. I mean, I guess as much as we can. I don't see why not. Cool. And now we just fill in the rest. I did not mean to do that. Now we just fill in the rest. Okay, looks like all this stuff is actually done. You're going to have some coal left over. Nice. Grab all of this. There we go. Now, this should be enough to give us, I mean, at least a bit of room on the thing. Okay, you? No. No. Lurkers are not welcome in this world. And what is blowing over there? A dude skeleton? Hey, let's not. Hey, hey. No. Why is there a dude skeleton glowing over there? Angry zombie, you go away. There's no wisp or anything. What the heck? <laughs> okay, that's kind of weird then. Okay, so I got 60 more blocks here. Let's go and... Uh, really? Again? Really? Give, give me... Mm. Just... Wait, what? What? I'm so confused by everything right now. What is going on? This game is glitching. At what is going on? <laughs> what is going on? Everything is just glitching out. I can go right through it. Oh, wait. Right. Okay, okay, okay. It was just glitching out because the thing's already in there, so that's fine. So, do that. Break that. Okay. Give me that back. We don't want you to smelt just yet. Actually, you can't even smelt. There's no lava in here anyway. Let's just finish this thing off. Okay, that should do it. Let's go and get rid of all this dirt. Okay. Yeah, now it's got a lot more space. Okay, cool. So, okay. I do have a bucket of lava over here we could actually use. Uh, I hate doing this, but I don't have a choice. All right, give me that. Let's throw you in here. Yeah, there we go. And now it should actually be able to start smelting stuff. So let's go ahead and grab some things. See what we can actually get out of it. Do I have any ores of any kind? No, of course I do not. Uh, oh, well. I actually have to start smelting gold first. That's uh, kind of one of the key points right here. Okay, so... All right, so yeah, that should smelt fine. We actually don't need that much, but I just want to make sure that I have enough for what I need to do. So while that's going, I need to make a couple of stencils. Um, You know? Uh, yeah, let's do a hammer first. Why not? Okay, so for the hammer, I need one of these. I need... I think it was this one, right? Hold on. Hammer. No, I just need that tool rod. Okay, so this one. Wait. Okay, there we go. Tough tool rod, there we go. And a hammerhead. Yeah, okay, cool. So then you just put that in there. Do that, and you have yourselves a, uh, whatever you call it, like a mold of some sort. I honestly cannot say I remember exactly what they're called. <laughs> Either way, so that's actually pretty cool. Why does it say cheap? Oh, I could actually probably make stuff out of these. Yeah, well, I don't need to. So, okay, cool, so that... Oh, it actually tells you how many blocks. Okay, that's actually really nice. Okay, okay. So, first things first, we're putting one of these sear bricks in here, and we're going to make ourselves our first cast. There we go. Cool. So, now we have an ingot cast, so we can pull these out individually whenever needed. And now I got to make this stuff. Oh, that's the wrong thing. There we go. <laughs> Man, I am really just an idiot sometimes. Okay, cool. There we go. Okay, so now I have to empty all this out. Okay, I it tells you the individual ingots and how many blocks are left. That is so nice. And I accidentally made a blank cast because I'm stupid. 
Right. Okay. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I'm stupid. Okay. So yeah, that's how I pull them out individually. And then I can go ahead and just get the blocks out too. Okay. Wow. Look at this. Hold on. It slowly fades into the thing. Oh, that is so cool. Man, I love this version of freaking Tinker's Construct. This looks awesome. I am loving this. Unfortunately, the blocks seem to take a lot longer to actually uh, harden up or solidify, so that kind of sucks. Oh, well. Oh, you can even see the little cobblestone on the park builder. Oh, that's so cute. <laughs> I love this. This is actually all really cool. Oh, it even shows up. Oh, that is so cool. <laughs> I love the crafting station. This looks so freaking cool. Awesome. Okay, okay, cool. Okay, cool. So this thing's empty. So now we can go ahead and throw a bunch of iron in here. Don't want to accidentally mix it up with gold, so it's good to make sure you empty your stuff out before you actually put anything new in. I was stupid and put the cast I need over here, so let's go ahead and actually grab those back. And I already need some water. Cool. There we go. Eight blocks of iron. Okay, cool. So this is actually re uh, relatively easy. All we have to do is just put it in the cast. I mean, it's really not that bad. Slowly filling up. Slowly filling up. It's nice that the cast also tell you how much it's going to cost you to make each piece, too. I'm slowly fading into existence. Come on. You can do it. Solidify. Come on, you can do it. You can do it. You got it? There we go. Cool. And now I got to do more. Okay, cool. That's actually all the pieces we need now to make the hammer. Oh, it's going to be nice. Okay, so let's go ahead and throw these in here. That there. Boom. Got ourselves a hammer. Okay, cool, cool, cool. So the really cool thing about this thing is it actually mines in a 3x3 three three area. So let me see. Let me see if I can find it. Actually, can I do it on, on this? Yes, I can. And it actually shows me. Oh, it's never done that before. Oh, that is so cool. I don't know how many times I've said, oh my god, this is so cool. But this is actually really cool. Oh, I am in love with that. Okay. Yeah, and the durability does go down by how many blocks you actually break. Okay, so, yeah, that makes sense. Wait, what does it mean it has magnetic on it? I'm not entirely sure what that means, actually. Well, okay then. All right, so the other cool thing we can do, though, is let me go ahead and grab ourselves a diamond here. Actually, one of these two. I think that's all I need. Yeah, and we're going to make ourselves a modifier on this thing. Let's head over here. Throw this in here. Throw diamond. And yeah, this will put a diamond on it. So it'll increase the durability by, I believe, 500. And it'll also allow me to now start mining obsidian. So that's pretty cool. And I think this is how... Diamond can only apply once. Okay, diamond can only be applied once, but you're supposed to be able to upgrade how many modifiers you can put on it. Except I can't say I remember how to do that. Okay, it was that, and I swear I thought it was a gold block and a diamond. Okay, so I actually had to look it up. So it turns out that with this, I actually changed the way you do modifier, or you can add modifiers to weapons and stuff. So, unfortunately, it seems this, embossment. This is the modifier that we actually have to use. So, okay, because traits are on certain things, I need the paper trait. So, I need the paper something. And I need green slime crystal, blue slime crystal, and magma slime crystals, plus the gold block to be able to actually add more modifiers to this. So, that kind of sucks because I don't have any of that stuff. <laughs> Well, crap. Okay, so that's going to be kind of annoying. So I can't really work with that too much. But I can at least put redstone on here, I think, if I even actually have any. Do I? I have one whole piece of redstone that I could put on here. Okay. Well, either way, yeah, let's go ahead and throw you on. There we go. So now that has a modifier locked into haste. And I also want to put lapis on here, so that way we can get uh, multiple drops of stuff. So, I will take some lapis. 
Eh, okay, that'll actually be enough for now. I just want to get it on here so that way I don't accidentally replace it with something else. Let's throw that in there. Good. Is that it? Yeah. Okay, cool. That's actually it. Okay, so this hammer doesn't really look like much for now, but it's still pretty decent, especially considering the combined 3x3 three three areas, and it actually shows us. I still love that so much. Either way, so now I have a hammer, and... Okay, actually, I want to check this. Okay, how much damage? Oh, 14. That's not bad, actually. Whoa, what? Hold on. I saw something there for a second. Those moved on their own. Hold on. <laughs> Okay, okay, so that's actually the magnetic three quality then, because if, what it says is if I use it, or if I break something or uh, whatever, the items will actually get pulled to me faster? Let me see if I can actually find an example of this. Uh, that. It moves slightly. Yeah, see, it's moving towards me. Oh, that is so cool. Okay, so that's actually really nice for mining. Okay, cool. Well, I think that about does it for what I can actually do today with the Tinker's tr uh, Construct. Cool. All right, so I'm actually going to go ahead and end it here for today's episode. So that's... I'm loving the new Tinker's Construct stuff. I've never messed with this update, and holy crap, I am absolutely loving it. It is crazy. There's just so many things I can do with it now. Especially, I can't wait to actually upgrade this thing even more. You know, as soon as I can figure out how to put more modifiers on it. Either way, I think in the next episode, I may work more into this. Maybe actually try and make a pretty decent weapon out of it. I'm not entirely sure just yet. Either way, so, if you guys enjoyed today's episode, I'd really appreciate it if you guys hit that like button. Also, subscribe to the channel, so that way you guys can catch up on the rest of the series. And also, there is a link to my Discord in the description below. I'd really appreciate it if you guys stop on by. It's a lot of fun. So, other than that, I hope you guys have a wonderful day today. And you all are awesome.